morning, everyone. My name is Jim Zentner. I'm the new dealer sales manager with Astronautics Corporation of America. For those of you who are unfamiliar with Astronautics, we are an avionics manufacturer who have been in business for close to 60 years. In that 60 years, we produced over 170,000 primary flight instruments that are flying in basically everything, from helicopters to mid-range to the big irons such as the 787 and the 747s. We occupy both the military and the civil markets, and I'm here at the AEA show for the first time to introduce our latest product, the Roadrunner. The Roadrunner is an all-in-one electronic flight instrument that is designed to be a drop-in replacement for those 5-inch ATI attitude indicators and horizontal indicators in your legacy aircraft, as well as replacing some obsolete and outdated EFIS systems. It is one unit that replaces two LRUs. It is designed for the medium to heavy aircraft and is suitable for IFR aircraft. It has an extremely low downtime to install in as little as one day, and it will significantly extend the lifetime of your airframe. It is designed to be a drop-in replacement. As I mentioned, we are putting it to size to be able to fit into the instrument panel where those legacy 5-inch attitude and horizontal situation indicators sit without changing the instrument panel. It also includes analog, uh, excuse me, legacy analog interfaces so that you don't have to change out your radios or your present avionic systems. It also includes new digital interfaces so that you can include the newer systems such as the FMS, weather radar, TCAS, etc., into that instrument panel without blowing it up. It is compatible with your instrument existing autopilots and it provides you now a growth path for all the future because it is a software enabled device. We are designing the Roadrunner to be suitable for a variety of, pla of platforms, not just one specific. So through the use of an adapter ring and an adapter cable, we can be put into helicopters or fixed wing aircraft. It is a level A certified device suitable for those IFR aircraft. It's rugged and reliable. Coming from a family of displays, it is achieving a real world 25,000 hour MTBF out in the field. It presents at a manufacturer retail price of $50,000, a very cost-effective option to upgrade your legacy aircraft when you consider it includes the internal HTAWs and it has a less than one day install time. Uh, please stop by booth 903, talk to myself or Dan Barks about deal arrangements or if you have any questions on the product. Thank you. Aero News Network's coverage of the 59th Annual AEA International Convention and Trade Show, live from Orlando, Florida, is brought to you in part by the following sponsors. Redbird Flight Simulations is dedicated to revolutionizing flight training by designing, manufacturing, and delivering affordable and innovative flight training technologies. Each Redbird device is designed to enhance the training experience for pilots of all levels, from student to ATP. Redbird is quickly becoming the industry standard for flight training. Since Redbird introduced its revolutionary FMX in 2007, colleges, universities, and flight training operations around the world have integrated Redbird products into their curriculum. It's time to discover what Redbird can do for you. Join the migration.